What's up, people? It's Brass from TechX. A very happy new year to all. This is my way of celebrating 2016. We'll be unboxing Asus ZenWash 2, which is the cheapest second gen smartwatch that you can get. The box itself is very stylish. It surely looks very premium. That handle above the box has a nice feel to it too. The watch is compatible with Android 4.3 Plus or iOS 8.2 Plus devices. You can easily switch straps. It has got all the features of Android Wear. We also have some apps that are made by ASUS. Their native messaging app that lets you talk to others and watch it just like the Apple Watch. We have a wellness manager as well. This is some high level shit that I cannot probably fathom. The only thing I understood was that it has a model number. Let's quickly open the box. We opened the box to find another box. Let's hope I don't find a box in this one too. Same stuff is written on the box too. And here is the man of the hour, the watch itself. It is looking quite good. Let me remove the watch first. This is a 37mm variant, which according to me is the perfect fit for smaller wrist. We'll keep the watch to the side for now. It is priced at $129 for the basic 42mm model. We have with us the smaller of the two, the 37mm variant. A fun fact here, smaller variant is costlier than the bigger one. Don't know what Asus was thinking, but yeah, we can do nothing about it. This is their proprietary cable. It is magnetic just like the one present in the MacBooks. We'll look at it in a second. We also have a standard looking wall adapter. Manuals are hidden in a nice way. It's nice to hide away the boring stuff. I had to literally look up for it. The metal rims around the watch make it look very premium. And the rectangular dial will surely make people think that you are wearing an Apple Watch. Not that I would want that, but they are surely very reminiscent. They are like the brothers from different mothers. It's like one is a Tom Cruise from MI5 and the other one is a Tom Cruise from Tom Gun. I'll leave it up to you to decide which one is which. Even Tim Cook can mistake ZenWatch 2 for Apple Watch. On the back, we have the model number and various other information. We also have this button on the side that makes it look like a traditional watch. The button has got a nice feel to it. I know the strap color is a little bit girlish, but they didn't have another color in the smaller size. I'll try installing a traditional watch strap and will let you know how that worked out for me in the next video. This is their proprietary charging cable. It has got this magnetic ends. It sticks to the charging port quite nicely, but it can be dislodged very easily, so you have to be careful. We will give you a detailed review after thoroughly testing it. Thank you guys for watching. Hit that like button if you like the video. Your feedback helps a lot. If you want to ask us anything about the watch, post it in the comment section. Subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next one. Till then, keep hacking.